Hey, photographers out there, how are you? I'm shooting this quick video from my hotel room at Imaging USA. Um, some of you are probably here down in Atlanta too. I just wanted to um, talk a little bit about everything that I learned at this conference, which is so much, too much to put into this video, but um, I attended sessions on marketing and selling and um, even some photography sessions about lighting and shooting. And the one I wanted to talk to today most about was about selling. And really the finance side of selling and why it's important to know what you need to make before you even hire a client or a client hires you. So for those of you that are new or for those of you that have been doing this for a number of years and you don't yet know what your target sale is, it's something that you need to figure out. You need to run some numbers and figure out how much on average you need to earn from every client and maybe that average amount is different if you shoot weddings and portraits but for every type of photography that you do figuring out the target revenue number the sale number that you need to make from each client is critical and why well in short if you don't know how much money you need to make from each client you can't prepare each client for what they're about to spend with you and we haven't talked a whole lot about sales, um, but I come from a background where we consulted a lot at the marketing agency and helped not only companies with marketing, but how to sell better too. And one of the things that all companies, photographers included, do a disservice to themselves from is by not setting expectations in the forefront. What this means is even though you want more clients in your business, you want to be making more money, sometimes just quantity of clients is not the right answer. You have to have the right clients who are going to spend the right amount of money with you. If you know what average number you need to make from every client working with you, you can prepare them during the very beginning parts of the sales process. So when they're reaching out to you, in some verbal form or perhaps in your price guide or in your email communications to that client, you need to prepare them for what on average clients spend with you so that you don't go to the shoot, they don't hire you if they're not prepared to spend close if not more than that number. If they walk away, you have done yourself a favor. If they stick around, you've also done yourself a favor because you set expectations and the clients have a better idea of what to expect when we start looking at printing images or creating albums and they're not they're leaving with a very good experience not a experience where they had no idea what to expect from a dollar figure from you so it's one of the the takeaways that I had from this conference that I wanted to share with you, there's going to be many more. In fact, I was um, drafting some blogs and some articles and stuff while the conference was going on. So look forward to hearing even more. And I'm on my way back to Philadelphia later this afternoon. Um, can't wait to get home and see my kids. And look forward to chatting with everyone again soon. Thanks.